This video is brought to you by CatBeast.com. Design your own custom snapbacks and hats. Yo, what's going on, guys? Shout out to Cat Beast for sponsoring this video. Make sure y'all go check them out. Get you a cool little customizable hat, man. Especially you got some hairline like me. Oh, clutch. Hey, y'all probably like, bro, why you yelling at me, man? I ain't seen you in a few months. How you just gonna come back like you never left? Oh, what's good, y'all? We starting this vlog like a real ass YouTuber. Hey, what's good, y'all? Got me some PR. <laughs> what is PR? PR packages. What is that? Free shit. Personal rep? Sure. I don't know what it means. Nani? What is it? Anyways, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another vlog. Hey, yeah, I'm dressed like, look, this is this, this, before I met you, I, they used to tell me I dressed like a dad. It was only destined to be. You have never dressed like that with me before I might, like, like when we first started dating. Bro, I, I hit a clean tray flip on you. First try, just because I'm that confident. <laughs> So anyways, what is in these? My child's Christmas stuff. Y'all like my backlash wave? Alright, open it up for us. Tell us what we got. Well, you can't show this. What do you mean? This is her stuff. I can't show it? Oh my god, I was so excited for this one. Like, I got the little Ooh. stitch one. Wait, why can't I show it? This is her Christmas, her birthday stuff. Oh, cause she gonna watch the vlogs? Look, it's so cute. Oh man, mama, you in for a surprise. Help me. We got more. I got this little bag. So like if she ever goes to like sleepovers, so like get your mom or something. She could just put her stuff in here, plus her diaper bag. And she's set. Okay. It's cold out. Okay. What is this, a blanket, a quilt? This is bigger than I thought. Well, that's great. I hope you guys enjoyed that haul. Go, go. Yeah, I'm gonna go Google. All right, y'all, so we came to Target to look for some pajamas. Good, yeah. Giselle picked out. She was like, yo, they gon', they got the deal, Charles. They got them in stock. So I came to this Target that's like 20 miles away from my house. Anyways, we get here, and that shit was not the deal. And honestly, it was just something that was like, you know, it's cool to do when you have a family, so you guys can all match. I don't know. For like Christmas pictures, something like that. Normally, you know, it'd be that like corny shit, like, oh, yeah, hey, look who on the grandma matching. But... Anyways, that shit didn't work out. Uh, they didn't. They didn't have it. So Giselle got some pajamas. What are you doing? Other what way? are you doing? Why are you doing such a bitch? Appreciate it. Where are we going? The Target to get my daughter's pajamas. Which one? We're going to another one. Why are you so angry? I don't know, maybe because you're a fucking piece of shit and you're literally disrespecting me in front of everybody. Like, Hi. what the fuck? I showed you the fucking pajamas we were gonna fucking get. We fucking get there, you start bitching. What did I bitch about? Like, what the fuck? You showed me pajamas that were $35. No, I didn't! I fucking literally told you that they were sold out! Yeah, everything you were showing me was $35, $40. Dude! Dude, that's I'm copyright. Sorry. Stop yeah. touching my car. Yo, just turn off the radio real quick. Sometimes I start missing you crazy. <laughs> What's good, y'all? We over here at the, I feel like I like it better like this. It look like it add more like, ooh. Some shit going on. Nah, I'm just playing. All right, guys, so we over here at another Target, man. I stayed up in the car because I was like, hey, fuck all that shit, bruh. If y'all probably like confused as shit about what's going on, you're probably like, what the fuck? Look, I'm going to keep it real with y'all. Basically, went over to this Target because she was like, she was like, bro, I'm going to be real with y'all. I don't give a fuck about the pajamas. Like, I don't, I don't care about none of that shit. I was being considerate because I know Giselle really likes it. And she likes, she wanted all of us to match. And it's like, Giselle likes to get real festive. I like Christmas too. It's one of my favorite times. So I was like, you know what? You really like this. All right, let's go get these pajamas you want. Because she'd been showing me pajamas. She showed me like 12 different pairs. and But initially, she told me, she was like, they're like $35, you know? So I was like, she was like, I have this coupon, all this whoop de whoop. Not they're like 35. She's like, there's these other ones, they're like 45. And I was like, all right, yeah, all right, cool. Cause she wanted to take pictures in them and all that. So I was like, all right, cool little family stuff, I guess. Cause you guys know, like once once you got a family, you guys can do all that corny shit. And it's like, hey, bro, it's it's lit. This is my little goofy ass family. So I went over there. I got irritated because, like, honestly, if I'm being completely real. Like, I, I'm not trying to be wasting money on some fucking bullshit. Like, I know, like, I've done that. If you guys watch me, I've done that a lot in the past where I buy shirts and all this random shit. And I don't even like that shit. So, I was sitting here, like, I initially went to the store because I thought it was like, I thought she had, like, you know, I thought, I thought we was getting, the, I thought we was getting the deals, man. So, I was like, all right, shit, cool. 
um so we get there everything like full price so like i was like i think i was gonna pay like double for what i was paying i was kind of irritated because like like if you're around somebody like you know everything like that's going on with them you know you know everything that's going on so i was really like you know i don't really got like you know money to be wasting right now and you she know that so it kind of fucking irritated me that she was just like hell bent on getting these things where it was like well i want them like i don't care i don't care if you have debt like fuck it fuck it up shut up bitch Will it lock like this? Yo, I'm low-key scared to lock it like this because, like, what if she secretly left the keys? Because I was asking for the keys when she left. And she didn't say nothing. So, like, it technically wouldn't be my fault. I texted her. I tried to call her, but <laughs> shit didn't go down, bro. Whatever. We just gonna lock it. If not, it just, it just be one of those times where we all learn a lesson where it's like, hey, well, you know, you shouldn't, shouldn't play around. Do you have the keys? No. Swear to God. Swear to God, I don't need Oh, damn. I locked it. Yo, I gotta ask you though. What was that about? Huh? I'm still mad. <laughs> How did pajamas get you that hot? You shouldn't tell them people it's forty-five dollars or thirty-five max when it's really like sixty-five. I you feel me? Tell them. Come on, your mom like is from Deerland. Mommy, look. <gasps> Yay! Oh, yeah. <laughs> you let go of her? Yeah. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. God show me the way, cause the devil trying to bring me down. I'm just playing. I'm not trying to put you down. For the one person in the comment that think I do shit like that. <laughs> I'm joking. All right, Fro, you got the keys though? Or are we having a life learning experience? Oh, ah, y'all merely adopted the car. <laughs> Hey, all I want to know is, is you going to apologize? No. Dude, you're so salty. I apologize for you not seeing shit before. What? Dude, you threw a fit because I didn't buy it instantly because you told me it was a different price. Go, go. You got so. mad. Dude, dude, tell me this. I want you to understand the logic. <laughs> Hear me out. You can disagree. If you saw your parents struggling... Would you still be like, no, I want that video game. I don't give a shit. That's how I was acting, Charles. You didn't have to pay for anything. I asked you. I'm like, since I got the stockings, do you want to get the pajamas? So you paid I gave you something an double as much? Well, you know, I got the bills. The stockings was $50. I got a stocking. You didn't have to pay for the pajamas, but you said you were. I could have got the pajamas. And then I tried to find the best ones. And, but, but did and you, then did they you sold not... out in my size, so I'm like, we can't get those anymore because they don't but have anything in my size. did you not say there was size. another one that was $45? Yeah, and that's the ones we were getting right now. Yours, yours was the only one that was $24.99. Ours was cheaper. What, 24 How much was yours? $19.99. Okay, so, so do it with me. $25 plus $20? Mm-hmm. How much is that? $45. Okay, and then plus the baby? $55. Plus tax? $60. Yeah, what? The other one still had to get taxed. The other one would have been like forty, forty-five dollars. You want me? You have a calculator on your phone, boo. -boo. I don't. Anyways, so that's what this whole little petty thing was. Bro. Because I showed him yesterday. I'm like, do you want to get these pajamas tomorrow? He nah, said, yeah. Look straight up, fam. Those look straight, fine. No, fam. No. Because it's like pajamas, like, dude, I'm gonna wear them, I'm gonna sleep, away. I'm gonna wear them around the house, and that's it. Like, they're, they're so, they're, they're, they're cool. I know you like them, they mean something to you. That's not the point. The point is you were mad because you weren't met, you weren't paying attention to what I was showing you, and that's your fault. I wasn't mad. Yes, you were. Literally mad at me, disrespectful, in the fucking store. Disrespectful what? I just told you very clearly, I said, look. I didn't say I was going to pay all this much. You told me it was going to be a certain price. Okay, you want to enter the Twilight Zone? You told me it was going to be a certain price. I was like, cool. And you could have easily been like, I'll pay the 35 You could pay the rest. That would have been fine Dude, with you me. were giving me mad attitude, though. Because you were talking Look, shit. And you're like, nah, what the fuck? You got mad instantly instead of saying... But you understand this isn't a necessity? Yeah. That's fine. That's why the only I reason I went... Child. The only reason I went because this means something to you. And you like this. Okay. Your point is. Dog, I really can't believe all this stress came from this. From this little fit. What's up, what kind of buff dog? What's up, dog? What's up, G? Hey, dog. Chill, dog. Anyways, guys. 
Make sure you like this video or you're gonna get 500 years of bad luck. You don't want that. All right, guys, so we obviously, we're still together. I still have a little bit of hair left. Uh, yo, that's honestly, guys, that's why I haven't posted. Like, I was vlogging consistently, and then that day came, and normally, like, I don't have a problem uploading footage like that, because I'm like, yo, it's real life. Like, you know, everybody fights. That was, like, our first fight on camera, and I was just like, you know what, cool. Yeah, so I got kind of, like, stuck, because I know, like, I, I had that original, like, come back to YouTube. I was like, all right, guys, I'm going to start, you know, I'm going to be on this thing. But, um, yeah, I just got, like, stuck with that. But it, it's all in hindsight now. It's been probably, like, two, three months since that happened. I think that happened, um... November. November. Like, you were so salty about these stupid pajamas. He was mad first, actually. I, well, I got mad because, like, as you guys saw in the video, I was like, yo, like... He didn't show when he I was, was mad. I was under the impression. He showed, he's oh, no, I was in the store because she was like, she, she showed him and stuff. And I was like, I told her flat out. I was like, I'm not buying that. I was like, you told shit. me it was going to be. He was being rude. And then he was being rude to the workers. And I'm like. I'm like, fuck them workers. Like, she, she was saying that because I was like. Uh, she was just being really rude and it was pissing me off. Because she was, she said something like, hurry up so he can do his job. And I was like, this guy is not going to get off work anytime sooner. Whether he hurries up or not. I was like, he still has to stay oh, no, there until no, no. that time. You, you had my phone. And I asked you. Where my phone was, you're like, I don't know. <laughs> oh yeah, because she, she was pissing me off. I don't know. She was pissing me off because I was like, I got, I got irritated. Because I, I was looking for the sizes. Yeah. Anyways, so like, basically, she told me everything was gonna be like thirty five bucks, forty five. No, max. I'm telling you what. No, I'm telling you got you. mad, and you got me mad. You were just starting to piss me off because of the way you were acting. And then he's, I asked him where my phone was, and then he's like, I don't know. And I, was, yeah. and I went, I looked for my phone. I was like, okay, I don't know where the No, because though she was waiting with the work and all. Yeah, like, I was waiting because I needed to show the guy the little thing from the website or whatever, the little code. And then I, I was looking for my phone, so I wasted my freaking time and I was like, where's my phone? I don't know again. And then the freaking, I, I was like, give me back my phone because you can see it right there. So then he like. I wasn't I was holding like, her phone. Awesome. But it like time had passed and the dude's like just waiting there awkwardly like. So he could wait. Like what? I was like, I did it. And then he had my phone the whole entire time. Yeah, but I did it. I did it to be a dickhead. He was being rude. I yeah, no, I did it. I did it on purpose because I was like, like, cause she got irritated because like I was like, I told her I was like, I'm not buying that. Like you told me it was gonna be like thirty five, forty five dollars max, and it was like sixty. Yeah. I'm not just gonna buy whatever, so I especially showed something I didn't care about. I was like, I don't care. I guess you didn't care about it, but then you did care about it. So it's like you I cared about it because you cared about it. Like if I weren't with you. Or if I didn't have a family, I would have never go buy pajamas like that. Okay, but so you do care about it. I care about it because I'm being considerate of you. Okay, but, but and you overall, if, if I'm being a, just myself, I don't care about it. Huh? Okay. Okay. Anyway, but you care about it. You care about it. At the end. You just, I didn't care about it. Enough if to I get wasn't. Mad about it. <laughs> but but yeah. you did get mad about it. That's the thing. You did get mad about it. No, I, anyway, I just. The $35, $45 thing he was talking about is because like prior to that week, that whole week, we were like, I was looking at different types of pajamas like online and stuff and whatever, trying to make sure they had all of our sizes and whatever. So I showed him and then he was like, okay, that one's fine. And then when we were going to go buy it, when we were going to buy it or whatever, they were sold out in my size. So we weren't. And then all the other ones I had showed him, they had no, like, they didn't have anything close to my size. Then I looked again and i found those target ones and then i showed i texted it to him and i showed him i was like are these fine she are sent me stuff okay? every day like 12 of them i was sitting there looking at these pajamas i was like man i don't give a fuck about these goddamn pajamas just pick See, some but I had holiday the pajamas that he did care about it so you know you otherwise know, i would just picked it out myself I, I was just and then for the whole pain thing it was like so I got stockings. I asked him, I was like, do you want to get the stockings or do you want to get pajamas? He didn't have to get either. I could have gotten it. But I asked him because, you know, just, nah, why you just not? Like, get one or the other. Why not? And then um, he's like, okay, I'll get them. So in my head, I'm like, okay, he's, he's going to get the pajamas. And then I, sh I had texted him the pictures from Target. The everything showing our side. But you don't know how like girls everything. be just they just send a bunch of stuff. You're and like, he didn't oh, pay attention. Did he wasn't paying attention, so it's his fault. I and mean, you do that a lot. You do not pay attention to stuff. You're like, you didn't do that. You didn't send that. Blah blah blah. No. And then I literally sent him those exact things. I'm like, okay, so they have it. They don't have it at the target next to us. They don't have all of our sizes. They only have the babies. So then I'm like, okay, so this store has all of our sizes. So we went all the way there and well, but anyway, we went we went all the way over there. 
I just, him she, to she get made mad it sound like something like, that I showed she, him. You got mad at something that yeah, I got mad because they were full price. And I was like pissing me off and hurting my feelings in the freaking store, making me look dumb. I was making the gum. All I said was, I'm, I'll, I'll tell you guys all exactly so then what I, I said. I, I blew up in the car. I, I saw was them. Mad. I was angry. I, was I saw them. And and I, was I, hungry. I saw them and I said this. I said, I'm not paying $25 just for one set of my pajamas and then 20 for yours and then another 10 or whatever for the baby. I was like, no, I don't care for these like that. I'm going to wear them for one month. Basically. She started getting mad though. And I was like, why are you getting mad? Like, you know, you know what's going on. Like, you know, the whole, like Christmas is about to come up and stuff like that. So I, I didn't understand why she was getting mad. I was like, why are you throwing a fit over me not buying these stupid pajamas? Was she was, mad? She was you asking for her that phone. I was not mad because of that. I was freaking mad because you were being rude. And I showed you. And if I, if you were like, you, if you would have been paying attention, we would have never been in that situation. If I would have never said yes to the pajamas, it wouldn't be no decision. You know, she got her way in the end. I bought the pajamas by the end of the vlog. Just because it they meant something to Giselle. I buy onesies, I bought all this stuff, and I'm like, Yo, you made, made you got mad, and then you made me mad. It's just, you got my reaction on camera. You're making it sound like I was like you, like where I was like, Buy that thing! The fucking pajamas! You know what I'm saying? I wasn't like that. I wasn't like that either. I don't know, big fella. <laughs> you was pissed.